I would like to go ahead and... <clears throat> you good? Okay, just checking. This uh, meeting of the Yuba City City Council for July 20th, 2021 to order. <laughs> Um, the governor has declared a state of emergency to exist in California as a result of the threat of COVID-19, while the governor recently issued executive orders N-7-0, excuse me, 07-21, which lifted certain orders and associated restrictions. There are still public health directives in place. Executive order N-0821 also allows local legislative bodies to continue to hold meetings via conference calls while still meeting state transparency requirements. The public health and well-being are a top priority for the city of Yuba City. And you are urged to take all appropriate health and safety precautions. This meeting is utilizing Zoom. For this meeting, we'll be using questions and answers functionality of the tool in order to accommodate public comment. On your device, the question and answer section of the app is located at the bottom of your Zoom screen. For those that would like to comment during this meeting, please enter your comment into the question and answers portion of the app. Be sure to state the item you will be commenting on during the public comment of each item. Staff will read aloud the comments provided by the public for all to hear for that specific item. Can I have a roll call, please? Councilmember Espindola? Here. Councilmember Harris? Here. Councilmember Kirshner? Here. Vice Mayor Shaw? Here. Mayor Boomgarden? Here. Uh, closed session would ask that our city attorney read the closed session items A, B, and C. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. We have three items for closed session this item. Item A is Conference of Labor Negotiators pursuant to Government Code Section 54957.6. Agency designated representatives are Dave Vaughn, City Manager, Brad McIntyre, Community Services Director, Spencer Morrison, Finance Director, Diana Langley, uh, Public Works Director, Michael Jarvis, LCW. The employee organizations are Yuba City Police Officers, Police Sergeants, Yuba City Fire Management, Police Sworn Men Managers, and Employee and public employees, local number one, item B is threats to public services or facilities pursuant to government code section 54957, subsection A, consultation with city attorney and and or city uh, fire chief, a police chief, director of public works, IT managers, and city manager, and item C is conference with legal counsel potential litigation pursuant to government code section 54956.9D1, one case. Thank you, sir. Any comments from the public? I'm not seeing anybody there online. No comments. Off we go to closed session. Good evening, everybody. Had to have the mic on. Good to see a full house in here. Um, so we're going to call this uh, regular meeting of the Yuba City City Council for July 20, 2021 to order. I have a couple of notices to read. Um, the governor has declared a state of emergency to exist in California as a result of the threat of COVID-19. While the governor recently issued executive order n 7 Two, one, which lifted certain orders and associated restrictions, there are still public health directives in place. Executive Order, order N-08-21 also allows local legislative bodies to continue to hold meetings via conference call while still meeting state transparency requirements. The public's health and well-being are a top priority for the city of Yuba City, and you are urged to take all appropriate health and safety precautions. How to participate in this virtual meeting. The meeting is utilizing the Zoom application for this live broadcast. For this meeting, we will be using the questions and answers functionality of this tool in order to accommodate public comment. On your device, the question and answer section of the app is located at the bottom of your Zoom screen. For those who would like to comment during this meeting, please enter your comment into the questions and answers portion of the app and be sure to state the item you will be commenting on. During the public comment of each item, staff will read aloud the comments provided by the public for all to hear for that specific item. Please be timely with your questions as once the public hearing is closed or the item has been discussed by the council and voted on, no more comments will be accepted for that item. May I have roll call, please? Councilmember Espindola? Here. Councilmember Harris? Here. Councilmember Kirchner? Here. Vice Mayor Shaw? Here. Mayor Boomgarden? Here. I would like to invite uh, George Barlow. He'll be giving us our invocation slash inspiration. And then if uh, you wouldn't mind, I'd ask former Mayor John Miller to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. And he just looked at me. <laughs> we'll start with the invocation. Thank you. Let us pray. Dear Father in heaven, I lift up our prayers for our city council as they are committed to the quality of life for each resident of Yuba City. I pray for their tireless mission in that commitment. Father, I pray for our first responders, those who have committed their lives to our safety, 
those on the front lines as I speak, fighting fires in other jurisdictions. I pray for those policemen and police women who are working their beats day in and day out. I pray for your hedge of protection over them. I pray for this great city as we prepare for the future. It is in your precious and holy name I pray. Amen. Amen. to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Barlow and Mr. Miller. Um, at this time, I'd like to have the city attorney's report on our closed session items. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. There was no reportable action taken in closed session. Thank you, Mr. City Attorney. Any agenda modifications? Through the mayor, we'd like yes. to pull item 10. Pulling item The consent 10. calendar. Okay. Good. Council? Council? I, All right. Clarification, Mayor, pull it from the agenda. 